So there's this new online game called Batter Up, which is kind of like Wordle, but for swings in Major League Baseball. So as you can see right here, they're going to show you a swing. You guess the batter based on the hints. It can give you team division, born age, all that stuff that you've seen from like Wordle and all these other baseball games. Shout out to Jolly Olive, seen him play this on shorts before. So I want to go ahead and try this one out. So just an example, I'll show you this one. This one's really easy. I mean, looking at it, this one screams Manny Machado. So you type in his name and bang, it is Manny Machado. So that's easy. There are like 30 plus ones of these. So we're just going to gonna go ahead and play them all and see how well we can do or play as many as we can until this video starts to get like insanely too long so let's go to the archive and let's go ahead and play all the way from february 19th which was the first version of this and here is the first swing this one to me looks like alex verdugo uh and i, I think i'm gonna be right with that alex verdugo swing right here and we hit submit and yeah it is alex verdugo so we are off to a hot start i don't think i'm gonna be able to guess these all on the first try i think that would be kind of shocking okay for this next one ooh. Ooh, okay, left-handed swing. Oh, man, I know that finish. Is it all current players? Oh, who is this? Is this? Is this just Otani? Is this just Shohei Otani? I, I don't know why he looks a little bit smaller than he normally would, but I'm going to guess Otani on this one. He is Japanese. I was going to say he's a Japanese player. He's a Japanese DH. So then would this be Yoshida, Masataka Yoshida? Are they just picking all the Red Sox players they are. Okay, I knew it was a smaller guy and I didn't want to say this, but it looked like an Asian swing, which might come off wrong, but you know what I mean. Uh, yeah, Masataka Yoshida for number two. Let's go ahead and move on to the next batter here. Got a right-handed hitter. Ooh, a little bit of a bigger swing. That finish looks so familiar. Right-handed bat. I actually don't know this one on the first try by any means. I'm gonna go with, ooh, he has the close stance too. Oh my God, I feel like if you give me like 10 more seconds, I could probably actually get this. The close stance. Oh, this one's gonna bother me. Why, why am I not getting this? Oh, this feels so easy. I feel like you guys are gonna scream at me. I'm just gonna go ahead and guess someone real quick. I'm gonna go, I'm just gonna go with Paul Goldschmidt. I know it's not Paul Goldschmidt. That's a bad guess, but we're gonna throw his name out there. It is NL Central. He is an American. Um, oh, NL Central. Okay, NL Central right hand to swing. It's not gonna be from the Reds. Oh. Oh, it's in the NL Central. Okay, so we got the Brewers. Is this anybody on the Brewers? I don't think so. Cardinals. Cardinals. I mean, it's not Arenado because he does like the double. Ooh, it, maybe it could be. No, it's not Arenado because he's not on the Cardinals. They didn't click that. Ah, uh, the Cubs. Cubs right-handed swing. I don't think there's anybody that that that's that big. Pirates. No. Oh, my God, it's in the NL Central and he's American and I can't figure it out. There's not that many good NL Central players. Let's just guess someone from the Cubs that's right-handed. I'm just going to guess. Oh, I hate this so much. I'm going to go with Patrick Wisdom. We know it's not Patrick Wisdom, but just to find out if it's going to be the Cubs or not. It is the Cubs. A Cubs right-handed hitter who is not in his 30s. He's a little bit younger. Am I really blanking out on this one so badly on the Cubs? Okay, catcher is going to be Jan Gomes. First base, they really had nobody. It was Patrick Wisdom. It's not them. Second base is not Nico Horner. Is this Dansby? Is this Dansby Swanson? I think it might be Dansby, actually. It's not Dansby. Okay, but the number is close. The age is close. Third base, it's not Christopher Morel. I don't think it's Christopher Morel. Outfield, Seiya? Is this Seiya? Seiya Suzuki? Is he just going Japanese? No, okay, it's not. Oh, it's USA. Oh my God, I'm so stupid. And it can't be Christopher Morel because he's not American. On the Cubs? Are we serious? Am I forgetting somebody so obvious on the Cubs right now? Who in the world could this be? What? Cubs, he's 29. He doesn't play the infield or outfield, which means he's a DH. Who was their DH this past year? I mean, is this Ian Happ? left hand right-handed swing it is ian hap's right-handed swing that's what threw me off was the fact that i was only thinking of righty switch hitter okay that one was legitimately tough see like some of these can be hard some of these i'm not gonna get on the first try oh, that's difficult Ooh, is this oh oh whoa, whoa 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 the open swing the finish like that god it's not it's not fernando tatis but that's where my head's going is this I just, I have to guess Tatis just to get my brain going. It's the only name I can put in my head right now. Okay, so it's the American League West with a right-handed swing that has that's open like that. Right-handed open swing in the American League West. So for the Mariners, I don't think it's gonna be anybody on the Mariners. This is a powerful, powerful swing. Unless it's, unless it's Julio? Well, no, he's not from the DR, so it can't be Julio. He's not an outfielder. I gotta look at these hints. These hints are just giving him away. Wow, I actually thought I'd be so much better at this. Uh, American League West, or it could be the National League. Oh, it could be the... Uh, 
Could this? No, it's not Ellie De La Cruz because again, Dominican. Could this be? Oh, it's not the outfield, so it can't be Acuna. Ah, uh, right, because I just want to see the help again. So if it's yellow in the division tile, it means it could be NL West. Oh, okay, so it won't be like the opposite league. Got it. So it's gonna be in the National League, National League Central, National League. You know, who this kind of looks like it kind of looks like Javi Baez. I know it's not him, but it kind of reminds me of his swing a little bit. Um, let's just guess an American in the NL Central now, and let's go with who would ever swing like this in the National League Central. No, we'll go National League East. We'll go National League East. I'm gonna go with Nick. It's not Nick Castellanos, but I'm gonna go Nick Castellanos. <laughs> We know he's not an outfielder. We know he's in the NL East, though. He's not American. And he's going to be an infielder, probably, based on the fact that right field is not popping up. So this could be on the Mets, right-handed hitters. There's not a lot that don't... That, I mean, it's not Pete Alonso. It's not going to be Francisco Lindor. It's not going to be Francisco Alvarez, I don't think. He's a little... Oh, man, I'm going to be... I, I got to guess Francisco Alvarez, just in case. I don't think this is him, but I'd be a bad Mets fan if it was. Okay, so it's National League East, Venezuelan. Is this just going to be National League East, Venezuelan? And he's on the Mets, not on the Phillies. Braves, Venezuelans that are right-handed. It's Ronald Acuna. That's the only one. We know it's not an outfielder, but I'm just, I just have to guess him just to see. Okay, so it is the Braves. Is this Arcia? Orlando Arcia? He's Venezuelan. Is it? Wow, Orlando Arcia. Man. Okay, some of these are really, really difficult. I like getting them on the first try. Ooh, this left-handed swing. That's Ellie De La Cruz. That's Ellie De La Cruz. That one's easy. First try. Bang. Your mother. I don't know what to say there, but that one's so easy. He has a very, very recognizable swing. Ooh. Ooh, 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 I know this one too. This is Cattell Marte. This is Cattell Marte. This has to be Cattell Marte. I promise. Look, as I'm going, they're getting better. Cattell Marte, one of the most underrated players in baseball. So disgusting. Cash money. This one's Jeff McNeil. Dude, I, like, when I'm flying, I feel like it's probably, it's not Jeff McNeil. Oh, it's Bryce Harper. Wait, is this Bryce Harper? No, it's not in the NL East or in the National League. Oh my God, I was so confident that was Jeff McNeil. Wow, I guess he's a little bit squattier. And wow, that does kind of... No, it doesn't look like Bryce Harper. I'm lying. Okay, so he's American in the, in the American League. Who? Who's a lefty in the American League? Let's go with someone from the American League East. Let's just go Gunnar Henderson, just because we know he's a lefty. And it's going to be in the American League, American. Now let's go to the AL Central. Another lefty in the AL Central. Not going to be Jose Ramirez. He's not American. Uh, Royals. MJ Melendez? I'm just going to guess him to see if it's the central. It's not or closer in age. So it's the American League West and he's going to be American around age 25. It's not Kyle Tucker, I think, right? It looks like he's got a little bit of hair. Kyle Tucker? I don't like that. Oh, he like that. Oh, he's not an outfielder. He's not an outfielder. It's going to be a catcher? Is this a left-handed catcher in the American League West? Who the hell would this be? I'm just going to guess Cal Raleigh. Cal Raleigh, just because that's something that makes sense to me. Okay, it's not a catcher either. So is this a D8, American DH in the American League West? So for the Angels, I don't know who this would be. For the Rangers, mm, no, it's not Corey Seager. Could this be, who is this? This is actually so hard now. I thought this was Jeff McNeil so easily. Oh, How am I seeing other people's stances? I'm just going to guess Nolan, Nolan Shanuel is not a good guess either. Oh my God. We're getting further and further away. We know he's not 27. That was so stupid. I think this is going to be the first one that stumps me. It's not the Royals. It's not the Mariners. Oh my God. What? Am I really just blank? Jonah Heim? Is this Jonah Heim maybe? Jonah Heim? It is. Oh, it's not. It was Kyle Tucker. I said Kyle Tucker. Oh my God. But I've got thrown off by the hints. Yellow position indicates may have been mystery player secondary. Oh, I thought it meant that they don't play even. Oh, oh my God. It was Kyle Tucker. I knew it. I knew it. And I psyched myself out looking at the hints. That was bad. Okay. Ooh, whose is this? Leg lift, short swing. Is this just Mike Trout? Is this just Mike Trout? It's not Mike Trout, but it is AL West. AL West, he's around his 30s. Quick swing like that with a leg lift. The AL West. I know that doesn't really look like Trout, but I, I don't know why. That was just the first name that came to me. Okay, let's go with a Mariners American. Uh, is there anybody I can think of that's a Mariners American? I don't think it's going to be Ty France. That feels crazy. And the Rangers, this could be... Who could this be for the Rangers? It's not going to be Josh Young because the age. And I don't... I mean, all their other outfielders are not right-handed or American like that. In terms of the Astros, I mean, you're looking at like maybe Chaz McCormick, maybe... I don't know, maybe Alex Bregman? I th could this be Bregman? Could this be Bregman? I could totally see that being Bregman. It's not, but he wears the number two in the AL West. That should even it down a little bit. Rangers, again, I don't know who wears number two. 
A's? This can't be anybody on the A's, right? That would be that would be criminal to do that to us. And they're in their 30s. That's not the Angels. Could it be the Mariners, Astros, Angels, A's, Rangers? I, I wow, I don't Oh my god, that was so bad. That was so bad. Um, I feel like I'm being a little bit ridiculous here and not getting this one quickly. Number two in the AL West, that's American. I guess I don't know players' numbers that well. Let's get someone from the Mariners. Let's go with High France, just because that's the only name I can think of. Okay, he doesn't play for the Mariners. Uh, then it's gonna be the the Rangers. Rangers right-handed batter. We know it's not Josh Young, but just to see if it is a Rangers player, let's guess it. It is a Rangers player. A Rangers right-handed hitter. Oh, Marcus Simeon, you dumb idiot. You dumb idiot. It's Marcus Simeon. That is his swing. Oh my god, yep, that's Marcus Simeon. Okay, let's let's get on a hot streak here. Let's get on a hot streak, seem like we know baseball. Ooh, this is Brandon Nimmo. If this isn't Brandon Nimmo, I'm gonna scream. You wanna know why? Because I know that finish, the shuffle of the feet. Thank god it's Brandon Nimmo. Need to redeem myself. Move on to the next one. Ooh. Ooh, is this Brandon Marsh? Is this Brandon Marsh? Wow, Brandon Marsh, first try. See, sometimes I'm money with these guys. Sometimes I'm not. Ooh, whose swing is this? I'll tell you. In the in the dark with the shadow, this is an ugly, ugly looking stance right now that I feel like I should know. So let's go ahead and just guess someone in the NL East. Uh, and I know it's not Pete Alonzo. Let's go with, man, his hands start out so far and he tucks him back in. I'm just gonna go Austin Riley. Let's go with Austin Riley, see if it could be him. <laughs> It's not. He's in the National League. He's American. He's around 26 years of age. Okay, so now let's go to the NL Central. It's not Nolan Arenado. Let's go with... What? I don't know why I always go to the Cardinals first. Wow, this one's actually really tough. Do I know this way? I, you know, I'm going to go keep Brian Hay. Oh, he doesn't play third base. Stupid. Uh, let's go Andrew McCutcheon. I know that's very different. It doesn't really help. Okay, he played DH a little bit. He's in the NL West, played a little bit DH. Is this Will Smith? Could this be Will Smith? It is Will Smith. Okay, nice, nice, nice. I felt, I never realized, I guess, that his hands were that far away from his body, but when he starts off his stance, but uh, now we know. Ooh, I think this is J-Rod. I think this is Julio Rodriguez, and I want to say this, this is Julio Rodriguez. It's not. Ooh, this felt like J-Rod, that finish. I don't know why it felt like J-Rod. Okay, so he's American League, not Dominican, not young, not a center fielder. Is this DJ LeMayhew? That's the other name that's coming up. I just see the long bat. Yeah, I see the long bat that finished DJ LeMahieu. Maybe they'd have similar stances. Maybe they have similar swings. I don't know about that. Ooh. What is this? What? What is this swing? Okay, let's start off in the American League and let's go with... I don't know why I want to go MJ Melendez again on this. MJ Melendez is just kind of shouting to me. Wow, it's the Royals, an American League player for the Royals who played the outfield, who's around 25 years of age. Who could this be? I swear to God, if you gave me like Kyle Isbell, I'm gonna scream if you've given us Kyle Isbell. Kyle Isbell. Success. Kyle Isbell? How would anybody know Kyle Isbell's stance? I mean, no disrespect to you, Kyle, if you're watching this, but who in the world would know Kyle Isbell's stance? I feel like even on two chances, that was pretty good by me to go Kyle Isbell immediately. Uh, let's go on to maybe like two or three more. We'll, we'll do two more, we'll do 15 of them. Uh, ooh, whose swing is this? And then that bat throw is super interesting. Going low like that, starting high with the bat pointed down. I don't think I know this off the first, so we're just going to kind of throw out a feeler, and I'm going to go with Teoscar Hernandez, and he's not Teoscar. So it's not Teoscar. He's not in the National League, but he is 31. So let's go with an older American player in the infield, in the American League. I'm going to go with... Oh, that, it does look more and more familiar as I see it. The bat pointed down like that. The bat pointed down. Oh, I so know this. I so know this. I, it's not going to be Glaber. Oh, Glaber's not 31 either. That would have been a really bad guess. Uh, let's just guess. Hello, who am I going to guess? I actually don't know, but that bat pointed down is looking more and more familiar. As I keep seeing it, as I keep watching it, I'll watch this swing 100 times before I make another guess. You know, we're just going to guess Mike Trout because it's always it's always just a good one. Okay, so we have he's American. He's 31, probably not playing the outfield. So we got to go to the infield here. Uh, AL Central infielder. That's 31. Uh, Indians or no, they're called the Guardians now. My bad. Guardians. I don't think there's one that makes sense. It would be like Josh Bell if he was right handed. <laughs> Josh Bell. Uh, let's just go Josh Bell right handed. Let's swing a little bit. Okay, so it's oh, he's on the Marlins now. I forgot that this is not the old teams. He is on the Marlins. That was a waste of a guess. You stupid idiot. Dumb. Uh, how about the Tigers? For the Tigers, anybody who feels 31 years old that's American that maybe plays the infield? No. Let's go to the American League East. Easier Red Sox. Ooh, what about Trevor Story? Is he 31? Must be Trevor. Oh, it is Trevor Story. See, maybe I just subconsciously know this stuff uh, as we go to our last one here. He's got some hair. Why do I think this is Luis Campusano? Why is Luis Campusano coming to my mind? I don't care. We're gonna get, we're gonna send Luis Campusano. 
Okay, I would have felt incredible if I got it right there off the rip. Okay, so he's American. He's in his mid-20s, and he's in the National League. American mid-20s National League. Is this... Oh, it's not McCutcheon. Duh! I see the long hair, and I'm trying to trying to game this a little bit. In the AL, or National League East, with longer hair players. The Mets? No. The Phillies? Phillies have some hair, but they're all lefty. Braves? I can't think of hair on the Braves. Marlins? I can't think of hair on the Marlins. And then the Nationals? That would be crazy. I don't think so. National League Central? All I can think is McCutcheon, Ellie De La Cruz, Connor Joe? Could this be Connor Joe? Okay, National League Central is the right thing. What does it mean when the number is yellow? When the number is yellow, it means matching tens. Okay, so he's a single digit number in the National League Central. That's American. Connor Joe's 31, by the way. He feels kind of old. Uh, let's go with the Brewers. Should be anybody on the Brewers? Who's got hair? Who's got hair like this? I'm just gonna guess Ellie. Oh, Ellie's not American. That would be a bad guess. Don't guess that. Don't guess that. NL Central with hair like this. Wow, why is this being so difficult for me? That's in their mid 20s. Am I like forgetting somebody blatantly obvious? Because this is. This is a nice swing. It's a good swing. I mean, could it be someone on the Pirates? It, no, we just guessed the Pirates. Let's guess the Cubs. Let's guess the Cubs. Oh, could this be Dan? No. Could this be Dansby? No way. This is Dansby Swans. That'd be a bad guess. Okay, it's not the Cubs again. I do know that he fit the other stuff. He's 30. Yeah, idiot. Stupid. Cardinals and Brewers. Cardinals. 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 Who's like gonna be the the dude who could swing like this on the Cardinals? Is this a Reds player? Christian. I don't know. Christian Encarnacion Strand doesn't have hair like that, but I. Okay, it is the Reds. Reds American, who's older than 25, hasn't played any of the positions. I guess, which does not help. Am I forgetting? Oh, Jonathan India? Is this Jonathan India? It's gonna be Jonathan India. That makes a lot of sense with the hair too. Jonathan India, gotta be the most forgettable player in Major League Baseball. I don't know, do you guys wanna see me play more of this? Maybe I'll do this for shorts, maybe that's a better thing, but you can let me know down in the comment section below if you enjoyed it. I'll leave a link to play batter up as well if you wanna go ahead and give it a shot for yourself, see how you do. Drop a like on the video again though if you wanna see more of this. Subscribe to the channel so you don't miss out on the content. Follow me on all my social media, Giraffe Neck Mark links are in description. You guys know the drill from here on out. Thank you so much for watching. YouTube recommends you watch this video. This is my most recent upload, so click through those if you have not yet seen them. Thank you guys and I'll catch you all on another video. Bye.